Greetings and welcome to Let's Play Cursed 2. We got the final skull. It was hiding. But we can now enter the crypt. And see what awaits us inside. Jesus, that's a lot of stairs. I would be like, yeah, fuck that noise. The cold stone floor slime is cracks and holes. It's better to see much activity. Let's go to the right first. Okay. Uh. Oh. Green, red. Are you giving me a hint or something? Okay. Let's not go into uh, room number one. <laughs> it's a silly place. I hope that didn't bug anything, but I do have to say, uh, this game is quite well coded. I didn't have any crashes or bugs or anything. Unlike seven mages that constantly crashes for some reason. Okay, let's get to the second door. It seems to monitor some sort of energy output from the next room over there. A glowing gem or crystal object flows effortlessly above a pedestal. You feel like it's deadly to touch. It looks like a power source. A cold cadaver lies on a steel stretch. It looks as if it was being studied, it weeks of decay. We can't attack it. Just a warning office chair. There are some notes on the desk detailing research in the bombing and preservation. Many detailed blueprints showing some kind of shield tech and how to keep something in the form of permanent stasis. It reminds me of Shadowgate here, <laughs> even with the the burnt uh, torch there. The large barrel feels empty as I wanted a bit to check. You search the base and are surprised to find a box of shells. A tiny coffin wrapped meant for an infant. A disturbing sword, but at least there was nothing inside it. A large casket sits on the floor, Dracula style. You can see that it's open and empty. There's a mummy inside the coffin, leaning silently against the wall of its home. That's a scroll. Square bot sits upright with us inside, but could have been in all of these. I didn't get a hint about uh Okay. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> maybe next time we uh, uh, close the door, uh, we keep the coffin shut. Can I... Power of Christ compels you. So I guess you have to somehow figure out this. However that works. Uh... Oh, this is correct. At least something. Okay. 
Okay. Haha! -ha! Wonderful. We can't pick up the skull again. Uh, hello? Some banners hang along the wall, decorating the room with some color. A massive glowing energy keeps you from seeing what is stored in this room. You will have to find a way to get rid of it. Oh, this is not the... Oh, I thought this was the room. I... Okay. Zombie? Dead people? I wanted to check something. One second. I, I, there was a Easter egg apparently. And we also need to save. If we take the clean wreck with us. Here. Okay. Uh. Yeah, and apparently we have to close the game manually, so... <laughs> uh, what? Okay, thank you. <laughs> I, will, I will be my back. Well, that happened. Oh well. <laughs> let's, let's not talk about this again. Okay, let's uh, summon him the normal way and... Yo, Des, how many are left? I know there's but a single undead entity left, however I do not know where it lies. Okay. Thank you. Be gone. An old man is frozen hangs from the hook. There's no saving these people now. It is only a torn piece of clothing. A slab of bucket or sorted orchids here in the corner. You have no use for this. Whatever or whoever this used to be has it's actually torn in half. This looks like one of the beings who have fought before. This one won't be fighting anytime soon. A chunk of unidentified flesh hangs from a meat hook. A large body hangs lifelessly staring at you. It gives to the creeps. I wouldn't put have I wouldn't have put this white thing here because it, it looks like there's something. The room is too cold to get any use of this tray. It needs a good defrosting. Looks like a simple thermometer. Reads 40 degrees. There's some kind of indicator light above the doorway. This seems to monitor some sort of energy output from the next room over there. Looks like a simple thermometer. Can we... Break something? from the right from it looks have been severed. Can we hit this thing with the crowbar to destroy it? Imagine having to go all up all these stairs every time you need some items from your truck. That would piss me off. Well the crowbars are far most useful item. Uh, we take this. Maybe I have to shoot at this thing? Let's take the pistol. I mean, I do kind of have to say, so far the, the riddles and stuff like that, nothing has had moon logic in it. From what I can remember. It all made somehow sense. Uh, 
A glowing game of crystal up to put efforts near point of best you feel deadly to touch. It looks like a power source. Nope. Can't shoot that thing. A long wire goes from glowing crystals from other roof of the complex. Something else is powered here. Maybe we have to get the cutters or something and cut the wire. You get fucked. Uh, maybe you can destroy it with the crowbar though. I don't know. Nope. Okay, let's try to cut the wires. What can go wrong? Eh? <laughs> Everything. Uh, drop this, drop that, get the wire cutters, not the wire cutters, the, 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 this, maybe the saw, I don't know. Let's try these first. Ah, you cut the wire quickly, that's not shock yourself, you hope this was a good thing to do. I'm pretty sure it was the best thing ever. It looks like a simple thermometer, reads 40 degrees. It seems to monitor some sort of energy output from the next room over there. Did this... This is still frozen, so it wasn't powering this. So I guess the uh, barrier? A stone altar with a glass casket. Description Miss My dear Jennifer's body lies. Her, her sacrifice was pivotal for us. It is your friend Jennifer. Even in death, she looks so calm and innocent. This is what she has just been sleeping all this time. I guess I need the, uh, I need this to show to the, uh, to her father. It's a glass casket. Description reads: My dear Jennifer's body lies here. My sacrifice was pivotal to us, to friend Jennifer. Can, 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 I, can I attack her? No, I can't. <laughs> the glass cast has kept her body perfectly preserved. There must be a way to save her still. Oh, I just need her soul, which is in the... Uh, in that thing's... There's some kind of indicator light above the doorway. I have the feeling you need to defrost this. This it feels like an old man is frozen. Can I attack anything? We are still missing one zombie. So there's that. Oh, I'm getting attacked. Because I can't move. <clears throat> okay, um, I guess we ha now have to get to the uh, to her father. And show him the locket, so he uh, believes that, that this is not his daughter. Ultra fast speed. Okay. <clears throat> Maybe he gives us access to the tower? I don't know, there's also a dark cave I haven't encountered yet, so... Uh, well, we will see, we will see, there's still, uh, still a lot to do, still a lot to do. And I'm still happy with this game, well, so far it's, it's good. I'm, I'm, I'm happy that I made most of the progress, and... That, that I actually managed, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll focus in this game. <laughs> I mean, you know, I'm not the one who plays adventure games a lot, so there's that. Get to her dead. Uh, 
I should have remembered <laughs> taking two of these orbs with me. I wonder if they give you XP. Would be a nice way to farm XP for easy combat. Uh, these two items. Save. Again. Every slot. We already did this, so I'm not going to uh, get to all this. I I'm talking with him, your bastard, it's not your daughter, you can't hide the truth forever, blah 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 blah. What if I'm why? This! This is my daughter's necklace! She never took it off. I found this on her body. So you were right, that's not her in the next room then. This is all too much. Wait, on her body? So she's really gone then? It's all been for nothing? Sh uh, she was hidden underground. You must meet the complex blocked by the crystal skulls. It's the only place I'm not permitted to be. At least I know her body has been well kept so far. The place is used for preservation research, research, I think. But her soul is trapped. So she's just separated from it. I think I see what you mean. So how can we get her spirit out of that imposter? An exorcism? There has to be a way. Who put her there? Oh lord, I cannot accept this. It can only be her mother. She calls every shot here. She is the one that convinced me to trust the fake gen. This plot is all hers. I can't believe I was tricked. Listen lad, if she knew I found any of this out, I doubt she would e let even me live to tell about it. I need the staff of the moon. Yeah, that's right, the staff can draw the soul of its host. But as far as I know, it was lost to the ages. I do have a single lead though. I've heard of tales of the tower at the edge of town being connected to finding the staff. The tower is locked. Well, one of my only secrets in life is that I'm still hiding from everyone to this day. There's a console behind you. Enter the code Jesus. Enter the code Jesus. And you will find what you need for the tower. Okay. Thank you. Please do what you can do to enter our eternal torment. You may be able to stop this. Well, at least he's 829-80082. The tower key. Okay, thanks for guy. Swell of you. I will remember this. Okay. We can finally enter the tower. Let's override only the first save in case I needed those souls or something. I doubt it. I have the strange feeling there are, there are no uh, soft locks in this game. At least not if you take the obvious way. And I needed to talk to him in order to get the key to the tower. So maybe I just need two souls in the tower then or something. I, I, I trust the developer of this game enough that he doesn't have uh, total bullshit going on in this game. Um, we don't need the locket anymore. I kind of want to take the two souls with me. It feels like I may need them. I mean, for what else would I use them? We can drop the soap. <laughs> oh no, we dropped the soap. Oh, 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 not like that. Inventory Tetris. Okay, that looks fine. Okay, what will we fight in the tower? The Tower of Power. Oh, Jesus.
Okay. No! Oh, it's one of these puzzles. Okay, let's align the middle, I guess. I just have no idea how. That looks wrong. No, wait, the middle was also moving. Oh, there's a skeleton. Skeleton man. It reads the sun held high shall light the path forward. That looks correct. So this is, we only need to put the middle in the correct way, which I guess is the skeleton looking like this. This seems to be correct, so we don't need to do this again. Let's get... Considering they only go in four directions, I have a strange feeling that's gonna be odd. So we need the sun here. Then we need this like that. I said like that. And now we need to move this around a little bit. Ah! I'm so going to save because I'm not going to do this again. Two of these three maidens are demons in disguise. One will reveal the way forward. A demon can only tell lies. Release the truth to find your path. Oh god. The redhead is lying. I am innocent. Okay. So if she's telling the truth, let me go and you can move on. That girl in blue is lying and I tell the truth. I guess the red hat is correct. Yeah, that wasn't that hard. Only one of these gems will allow you to continue upward. Place gems on the scales and press the red button to compare the sides. The correct gem is a different weight than the rest. Is it heavier or lighter? You may use the scales four times, then place your answer in the slot. Choose wisely. An incorrect answer will be quite dangerous to you. Oh, Jesus. Oh, remember when adventure games had puzzles? No, I do like puzzles like that. I do like puzzles like that. I can't complain too much. This is not Phantasmagoria 2, the end puzzle. That doesn't do a lick of a sense. Okay, how many do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Jesus. Um, oh, what was the solution to that? Let's put 4 on each side okay so we can ignore those four none of these these are all the correct size so we remove these two okay They are the same. Now I just need to figure out... It's this one. Ha ha! Ha 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 Oh, 
fuck a Vony with cheese. Let me make a screenshot of that. That feels like something that yells for a screenshot to cheese. You know? And if you're doing something, we're cheesing here. Um, I dance across the floors in 1,000 tiny lakes, yet I cannot stand with no wall to lean on. That's a room. 40. You are... 40. When we look at each other, it turns everything around, but when you speak, I can only listen. That's a mirror. 38. We are full while at work, but empty at rest. My boss and I bear such weight on our chest. We are full while at work. We are full while at work. I have 49 close friends. They are all made of this fine gathering. I did not. Number 50. We are full while at work, but empty at rest. My brother and I bear such weight on our chest. So something you fill up. My brother and I... So, two things? Oh, 33, the boots. Or not? What was wrong? I dance across the floor in thousand tiny lakes. That's 40, that's the broom. 40, the broom. When we look at each other, it turns everything around. But you speak and you can only listen. 38, the mirror. We are full while at work, but empty at rest. My boss and I spare shots weight on our chest. That should be the boots. Wait, did I... Did I fuck... Did, 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 did I put it some... Did, did I put it in the wrong hole? <laughs> I did not. That's 50. Maybe I put it in the wrong hole somewhere. No, no, no. I did not put it in the wrong hole. I am very about the boots. Especially since only one boot is here. The thousand tiny legs must be in the, the broom. I dance across the floor on thousand tiny legs. Yet I cannot stand with no wall to lean on. That must be the broom. 40. We have... When we look at each other, it turns everything around. That must be this. Ah, oh, he couldn't make it. 50. 50 is actually here, that fucking asshole. So the boots are correct. It's not 50 because 50 is here. What is missing? 1, 2, 3. Is there a 4? One, two, three... There's no four, correct? Four! Is there five? I saw a six. Five, 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 five. There's no five? Do I see this correctly? Let's carry on. No five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven, twelve. Is there twelve? Twelve, thirteen. Thirteen, thirteen, I saw fourteen, fifteen, 
Where's the 16? 16, 17, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's 5. Because I haven't seen a five. Okay, let's put it in five. Apparently there's a five somewhere. Where is there a five? <clears throat> Forty. Thirty-three. Thirty-eight. One. Where's the five? Five the clock. <laughs> okay, how far was I? I was at twenty. Twenty one. Twenty one. Twenty one. Twenty one. That could be twenty one or twenty seven. Oh, that's mean. Um, it looks more like a seven. How, how does he do the sevens? Yeah, that's more like a seven. So is twenty one missing? I can't see a twenty one. I see a twenty two. I see 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Let's try, let's try 21. Ha! Ha! Even though it's always the same answer, I'm going to save. <laughs> oh, we are also over the time limit, okay. Well, let's, let's, let's save. I thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And we will see each other soon. So take care and hit the like button.